Hello everyone and thank you for joining me in another once human video. In this one I will quickly show you just best places to farm certain resources guys and it's always gonna be next to the spawn points so for the first one you wanna come here so level 17 broken delta right and it's the portal next to the Sunbury. I zoom in all the way you see my marker and here is the one cave so you wanna come here guys and then if you're looking for bananas just cut the trees, these trees like this, that look like this, right? So all this is banana here. And then if you need coconuts, you just cut these coconut palms, right? So it's a few of them here, but look on them, it need to be coconuts on them on top, because if there are not coconuts there, you're not gonna get the coconuts, right? So here is the coconut palms and the banana trees, right? So lots of banana trees and coconut palms, as you can see. And also, all this area there is more palms there then if you go a bit up here you will find even one apple tree right but it's only one so this is the place for the coconuts and for the bananas guys and then if you're looking for mushrooms right just jump down in this cave and you will find a lot of mushrooms here so as you can see, this is a big cave, so just walk around the whole cave and you will find a lot of mushrooms, guys. You can enter this cave from here also. And yeah, there is animals here also, but this is the place for the mushrooms, for the bananas and for the coconuts, guys. So right here, Sanburi and this portal. Can I zoom in all the way? The closest city is Meyer Market here, right? That's the first place, guys. So let's jump to another one now. Okay, guys, here we are on another place. This one is for Sage. So you want to come here, Broken Delta, on this mountain, on this teleport tower. And once you are here, just start heading down, right? And the first two are here. Then you can spawn the car or whatever vehicle you have. Just go a little bit down, right? Where these trees started to spawn. And yeah, now from here, so four of them are here, guys. That's six already, and the big pile now. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, this one I already picked up. 14 and a few of them are here, so 15, 16, 17, down there 18, so around 20 sage guys, around this spot, again on the map, this mountain right here, and let's jump to another location now, here we are on the third spot guys, if I press the map, that's again here, close to this first one, right, so next to the death seal to the left, and next to the securement seal or alpha, this is the most known one, if you come to this portal guys, all around here, it's gonna be, you can get grapes here, you can get apple, apples of course, and here is lots of these blueberries, right, so this is the top spot for blueberries, because the mostly they are blueberries here, but as you can see, you can get grapes, and again one tree with the apple. If you go all the way there, there is lots of blueberries also. So this is the top spot for blueberries, guys, as you can see now. And all the way here. And then just go back to the teleport to change the world if you need more. You know what I mean? It's all this and all the way there. I'm not gonna pick all that up now. Then you can change worlds here. And yeah, let's jump to another place now. Then the next place, guys, if I press map here, I'm standing in the Meyer Market, in front of the Meyer Market, right? So all around here, all around the Meyer Market, guys, you can find a lot of corn, I mean tons of corn, and also beet, a little bit of scarlet calamus, and lots of potatoes, guys. So if you are looking for potatoes for the corn, come to the Meyer Market, as you can see now. I will just speed up the video now to show you how much corn and potatoes are here and all this 
Scarlet Palamas and Beat, right? So I'm gonna speed up the video now, guys, and make a circle around the Meyer Market, right? Also, Hopton berries are here and these berries, but very little. You can also find silver sometimes. If you're lucky with the spawn and the Digby boy, okay. Nice, and I think this is the blue one, right, okay, so this is my first deviation. New deviation, rare deviations, or whatever you want to call them. Now hear the beats. And then again all these farms, guys. Here you can find cabbage. And again, potatoes, right? So all this, potatoes, I'm not gonna pick them up now. More corn, more beets. So just make a full circle, guys, around the market. And you will find a lot of these. So now again here, there is the fishing spot. Again, lots of beets. Lots of corn, right? So this is the top spot for the beet and the corn. And also you can get scarlet calamus, blueberries. And potatoes, of course. And once you are done, guys, you can just change the world again, do this again, you know what I mean. So, if you need corn and beets, just come to my market and make a full circle around it. We are not finished yet. This is now another site. Now you see, guys, the top spot for the beets and the corn. It's all around Myers Market, guys. Now you see how much I got it. Just from one circling around. And that's it for this place. So beet, corn, the top spot here, and potatoes. I press the map, so Meyer Market, all around Meyer Market, guys, all this. And that's spot number four. So now let's jump to another location. Here we are on another spot, guys, if I press map. That's here, Talgras Inn, right? Level 32, Chuck Peak. And when you exit from the city here, this is the top spot for the Honeysuckle, guys. So now, as you can see, all this to the right. This is all fun, it's suckle, guys. So if you need this plant, just come here and do this. Now again, there's lots of other plants here, like mushrooms. Here, right, then you can find the saffrons. But this is the top spot for the honey suckle. And all the way up to here. So all this, all this, all this there. And now on the another side, you can find another plants here also but not in that quantity, right? So the honeysuckle. Then on the other side here, potatoes are also here and wheat, guys. So now you see again, and the entrance just on the other side. Lots of honeysuckle. Then here is potatoes again. Then, okay, the saffron. Then if you continue here, you can find wheat. One wheat, two wheat. Then again, lots of honeysuckle here. And all around here, guys, so... This yellow shit. And one orange also. But top spot for the honeysuckle is this one, guys. And you can find a bit of potatoes and a little bit of wheat. Okay, let's jump to another location. And here we are on the next location, guys, if I press the map. There's this portal right here, when I zoom out, Chuck Peak again. So close to this Rotten Saddle, right, or the Inspection Point 091. When you come to this portal, guys, around here you will find grapes and apples again. 
So grapes and apples are here. And then you can again just change the worlds, right? And just do this. So four grapes in very close proximity. As you can see this now. And uh, if you go a little bit further on both sides, there is another apple tree here. And you can also find these Hafton berries and a few cornflowers here. So three cornflowers. Again, a little bit of honeysuckle, guys. And uh, Hafton berries. So this is mixed spot here. If you go on this side, you can find more of these. So cornflower, one corn. And then if you go on this side, there is pumpkins, sage, you know what I mean. So this place is filled with lots of things, but uh, mostly grapes, two apple trees. And now on this side, again, a little bit of corn and a little bit of pumpkins. There is more corn there, but I want to stick to this. So as close as to the portals as possible, guys. So this place for the grapes, for the apples. And for these flowers, you saw now what you can find here, right? So let's jump to another place now. Here we are on the next spot, guys. So if I press map, this is the last uh, portal here all the way in the chart peak. And if you need Scarlet Calamus or the other flowers, just come to this portal, jump down there. And just start running over this beach, you know what I mean. So I will now speed up a video again and show you. So for Scarlet Calamus guys, just come to this portal, jump down here and then just walk around, all around here, over this beach, right? And tons of Scarlet Calamus, then yellow lotus and other flowers, right? So if you need Scarlet Taramus or the Yellow Lotus, I mean this white flowers, this is the top spot and you can go now with this beach more if you need more, if you want again just yeah, Yellow Lotus. So from that portal guys, on the map, so right here, and this is the spot for the Scarlet Calamus down there, right? Okay, let's jump to another place now. Here we are on another portal guys, if I press the map, we are now here, so next to the Blackfell. And this is all around this city, inside and around, you can find the Loi Vera guys, so when you come to this portal, just go down here. Now I will speed up the video again and show you. Aloe Vera places that I know of, right? I just jump down here. Take this one. And once in the car, guys. Just drive here. Now you see where I am on the map. So that's all these spots guys. So this one, this, this, this. And then we are going over here. The next two are right here, guys. And if you drive around now, all around this, you can find one here, one there. So this is all, all around this city is a place for Aloe Vera and the closest portal is right here next to the Blackfell, right? Okay, so let's jump to another location now. Here we are on the next place, guys. If I press the map now, we are at the Deadsville again, level 2. And these two markers, this is wheat here. 
And I will show you now actually. Speed up a video a bit. So if you need weed guys, come here and just go around these fields. There is a lots of wheat here, so you need if you need for beer or whatever. It's a little bit further from that portal, but once you are here, there is really a lot of wheat, as you can see now. So I'm not gonna grab everything, but all this is wheat all there. So you know what I mean. And there is lots of other fruits if you go further inside of these gardens. So now we're gonna continue towards the other marker then when you grabbed all this right this is bananas here again coconuts right and this is all the oranges here so you can just then start cutting these trees guys and you will get oranges but not always So as you can see, every few trees you get one orange, so it's not great, but uh, this is how you can do it. If you want to cut all these trees, guys, you will find a lot of oranges like this, right? And that's it from this spot. I press on the map again, so it's all here. This is orange fields, there is wheat fields, lots of other fruits. And let's jump to another location, guys. And here we are on another spot, guys. If I press the map here now, that's the bear cave, right? It's all the way up here, Chuck Peak. I made a separate video about the bear cave, if you wanna watch that now. The closest portal to go is here. So just go on this portal, drive around here. And this is the first entrance, you can enter it from here. Also, and this is the main place, again, for the mushrooms, guys. And for the bears for the bear meat right because it's a bear cave so it's a lot of bears here and lots of mushrooms when you do a full run of this cave guys you can get uh, around 30 mushrooms i think 31 or even 32 so i'm not gonna do that now but uh, the full cave is all the way here so when you go through all of this you will find a lot of mushrooms a lot of bears if you need meat and heights and let's jump to another location guys Okay guys, here we are on another spot. This is multiple spot with multiple resources. But mostly for the cornflowers, right? You can find cornflowers here. Then a little bit of sage. A little bit of corn. I mean, this is pumpkins, not the cabbage. Then if you go further here, there is oranges. Again, cornflowers. And uh, Captain berries, you know what I mean? And then all this, if you need seaweed or shellfish, guys, there is lots of rocks here, you know what I mean? You just crush them and pick up the resources. And then go back, change the world, and do it again. So cornflowers, seaweed, shellfish, cabbage, not cabbage, but the pumpkins are here, and a little bit of corn and sage, guys. So let's jump to another location now. And here we are on another spot, guys. If I press map now, it's Chuck Peak again. Level 36. Closest portal is this one here. And then you need to drive all the way down here on the beach, right? And once you are here, all the way up to this road, you will find lots of different plants to harvest. But from here, guys, Hafton Berries. If you're looking for Hafton Berries, just come down here, and all these swamps here are full of these. I will just now quickly run a bit through here to show you. All what you're gonna find here is gonna be Hafton berries, right? Mostly them. So. Lots of these cars also here, so a little bit of fuel. If you need, you can grab all these cars. And all the way, all the way up somewhere, about here. So half to berries, guys. All actually, all the, all the way up to this river here. Now we can go more, but not gonna be as much as here. 
So all these guys, if you want Hawthorn berries, all this area is full of Hawthorn berries, right? And I think that's it from this video. I showed you lots of places with lots of different foods. I mean plants that you can grab for different recipes. And if you like this video guys, consider liking, subscribing and commenting. And join me in another once human video where we're gonna do something else. Until then guys, bye.